Hello everyone, welcome back to a new video. I am Swam from Decreto. In this video, we will show you how to make filterable gallery without using Elementor Pro. Here I am using only Elementor free plugins that are available on WordPress. So we will use this and make the filterable gallery with awesome effects. If you click on the zoom button, then it will come with light box effect. So with cursible options and everything. And if I'm hovering on this, if you click on this filterable, so only camera pictures will come and camera lenses, the camera lenses will come and camera bag. So only bags will come. So in this video, I'll show you a step by step how you can do that. So let's start the video. So if I go to the WordPress dashboard, then click on add new plugin and search for essential add-ons. If I search for essential add-ons, so the first plugin will come that is essential add-ons for Elementor by WP Developer and it is 1 million plus active installations so we have installed it and activated it. i already installed and activated it so i am just deleting the full filterable options then i will show you from the first from scratch so let's delete the full section now click on update and if i now reload this page again now it is now everything is fine it is the fill blank option now we have to search for the filterable widget so at first we have to select one column so uh, here i'm selecting one structure column and then box i'm giving to full width and column gap will be no column gap then height will be fit to screen like that and then click on the plus icon and insert the one inner section so i want to make it to center in the middle in the bottom horizontally middle that's why i'm giving this so go to the um, duplicate this column then click on the column and make the size will be five percent or maybe ten percent and make the same as the right column ten percent and now click on the plus icon and search for filterable if you search for filterable so after typing this fil the filterable gallery will come by essential address that's why it is the ea water mix each level here so if i am just place the drag and drop the widget from here so as you can see that there is roughly happening everything it is not image or it is not showing any filters everything so we have to control over there so i have to i'm just click on the section and make some padding over there so i'm giving 50 pixel top and now update this so after updating if i press this page our filterable gallery looks like this if you click on gallery so it will not work because we have not said anything so we have to control the offer we have options many options if you click on the pen icon here is the lots of options to customize it like settings filterable call downs color items and load more button everything so at first click on the load more button if we upload six above six as six images then we have to option that is load more button if i click on the load more button so it will come rest of the images so for, for we have um, now anything nothing images so after uploading day by day it will come so that's why at first we have selected the load more button also you can select the inner space if i click on only three pages then only three pages will come then the load more button will come so i'm not giving it to three so make let's make it to six as usual then click on the settings you can also change the icon from there it is the icon library if i'm hovering so the zoom icon will here so if you search for zoom like if you search for anything search only search so it will, if i'm hovering now the search button will come that's how you can change the icons now click on the filterable controls that's the main option so we have to some copy one co column so if i'm selecting so we have to put the name like if i'm writing from the first if i'm show you in the intro that is camera camera back camera lenses which you want to do in the filters so like if i'm searching only for camera from the camera tab i will show only camera pictures in the camera top that's why i'm selecting camera now i'm copying this again and selecting camera lenses for the camera lens tab basically it means the like a tab if you select one tab so all the images will be under in the tab so then if i'm copying once more and then camera lens will be from the camera bag like that if i'm writing camera bag now it is looking fine and then update this after updating let's make some customization go to the style tab and make the background color so i'm giving the background color to light sky color 
sorry i'm giving the white color then go to the section color and go to style tab and then let's make the color to light blue color like this this is a blue color now after updating this page now click on the section again and give the border dash some border dash so i'm giving it to 10 pixel border dash it will not visible to us because of the padding so i'm giving more back padding increasing the padding like that 100 pixel now it's looking fine and make some padding to 150 like that now click on the pen icon then give some padding over there padding will be like 20 or maybe make it to 30 it's looking fine make 25 30 is over there so 25 is now fine and also give some borders from there you can choose it increasing and decreasing by that so i am giving the only 10 pixel borders so time next is fine now give the control style so there is the control style also you can change the borders from there so i am giving the 10 pixel again so and now click on the item style also give the borders from there as you can see that the border corner are now rounded lightly rounded and this is the control style so we have to make some color if i'm just click, you can see that the text color this is the active color if you want to change the active color so like that if you want to change active color this is the active color is changeable and the background color also it can be changeable like that if i'm just hovering now as you can see this is changeable now it is the border so keep some borders from there let's make it to 5 pixel and this is the typography also you can change the typography from here so let's make it to poppins font here is the poppins font and now make some border radius to 5 pixel and give the item style also you have to item style make some item hover style if i'm hovering it will sorry give the item style and go to the control style and make some active this is the text color so you have to make some text color like the blue color then you will see all color all the text will be blue now if i'm hovering uh, sorry update this and refresh this page so our filter color looks like this if i click on this camera then it will not work because we have not set anything so you have to set the images and controllable options so for that we have to go to the item hover style and if this is the background color if i'm hovering so background color will be light black if you want to change to light green so make the light green from there now let's make it to light light blue color if i'm hovering now you can see the blue color will come so at first i'm giving the default color like the black color so there's the black color if i'm hovering so it will come now as you can see this is the gallery item name and this is the description so how you can add that go to the content and close this and click on filter with cooldowns we have already set the camera camera lens bag and everything now go to the gallery items there is the options to make and change everything so i'm cropping deleting all the names and then click on the gallery item name and now if i'm searching for camera one and copy this code text so this is the camera one i am scrolling down so now as you can see this is the images so click on the image and if i am selecting this image and click on insert media so it will update this so like that we have to install one more so i am just click on the copy and then just change the name like that camera 2 and also change the image from here if i'm selecting this image so it will come then i'm still copying the one more once more so if i'm writing camera 3 like that and then choose the image from there so i'm choosing this image so there's the camera one two three now if i'm selecting only camera icon only camera tab sorry only camera tab so only three pictures will be shown in the camera tab so how do you do that so click on the filter table controls and click on the camera and copy this text code and and go to the gallery items and click 
expand on the camera one click on the camera one and then here you can see the control name we have to paste the control name which i have done in the filterable controls so i'm pasting the camera so now if i click on the camera only this image will be available here so like that which images do you want to shown in this camera tab you will put the camera control name here so if i'm writing camera 2 and pasting the camera camera name and then camera 3 and pasting the camera name like that if i'm updating this page it will gonna work so at first i'm giving the style tab and go to the item style sorry control style and let's make the text color to light color to like that text color so it will just dark color that's why it is looking not so good now let's make the some more images like that color items and copy this code take copy this text and let's make change to like filter controls this is camera lens so copy the camera lens and then go to the gallery items and let's make the control name to camera lens and this is the lens so camera lens we have to like lens one if i'm writing and if i'm selecting the image like that image this image i'm selecting i want to select so only if i click on camera lens only the lens will come if i click on camera lens the only lens will come so after updating it will work so i should click on the update then if i'm copying this code and then if i'm copying the lens one and if i'm searching for two so there is two now let me change the image so here is the image if i'm writing this image if choosing this image now go to the update button and if i reload this page again so as you can see that the images will finally loaded now if i click on camera only camera pictures will come if i click on camera lens only camera lens will come so that's how the process how you can add the images with filterable tabs so if i'm duplicating once more so it looks more good so if i'm copying once more and only change the background image sorry picture image if i'm change the back image like that this image and now update this so after updating if i reload this page so this is our pictures and filters looks like this if i'm selecting camera the cool camera text will tab will come and the camera images will come if i click on camera lens only lens will come and if i click on camera bag we have not set in camera bag that's why it's not come so as usual how to i will show you how to make the changes in the links and everything so go to the this code go to the lens from uh, filter controls and as you can see this is the camera bag so we have to put the same name we have to put the same filter label name in the gallery items control name like that in the control name we have to set the camera so we have to save the same name in the filter controls otherwise it will not work so that's i'm what i wanted to saying so that's the process how you can make a filterable gallery with working tabs with Elementor free version in the using some free plugins so i hope you learned something new today and if you like this video please give it a big thumbs up and comment down below how is the video and if you want to get more videos like that please subscribe this channel like this video and don't forget to click on the notification bell icon to get get first update about our videos and if you had any ideas about elementor wordpress comment on your address we will make up the topic later see you in the next video till then bye bye thanks for watching